Hey, what's going on y'all? Tanita Tai here. All right, so I'm going to be hitting up to a retreat soon and I was about to go get me some wine and then my body, like I just felt, I got like a, a image in my head like, no, okay? And to rest, pause to get my body ready. And I'm like, get my body ready to get my body ready for the information that is about to, you know, come in me, the, the insights, the, the clarity that's about to unfold for me and that I need to have my body right, energetically right. I need to take care of my body physically, mentally, emotionally, spiritually, even more. Of course, I'm doing stuff now, but I can do more. And that's what this is all about anyway with this Best You series for this 100 days is just improving yourself because you're already being awesome anyway, but just to improve more on that all every single one of us if you're the smartest person in the world you can get smarter so to get my body right and this is message is for all of us who wants to take heat to it is if we want to develop in a way that the, exactly how our blueprint was meant for us like our birthright the reason why we're here to fulfill our destiny we have to ask ourselves are we doing the daily action steps that we need to do in order to fulfill this prophecy that is over our lives? Like, are we actually taking the steps to? And it can be little steps, simple things that can have such profound long-term effects on you, such as one of my biggest things that I'm gonna have to work on now is not eating so late. And I have a really not so good habit of eating like those full course meals, like, mm, mm, mm. We turn them up and then I and then I get I'm already sleeping anyway and then I wake up and now I realize oh okay oh oh you want your stomach to be like that but are you even doing the habits are you even allowing your body to get ready for what you want to accomplish with that goal and so we have had to ask ourselves ask yourself that like what you're doing is it in alignment your behaviors the way you're thinking right now the the things you're eating right now um if you're working out doing some type of form of exercise right now are you meditating are you allowing yourself to to get still to get clear to get a better understanding on the direction that you need to take or get the, the next steps to your destiny that, that you are here to fulfill like are we actually doing the things that we need to do to have our physical bodies ready for this information to have our spiritual bodies ready for this information and even like on the spiritual tip you know watching the things that we are um, listening to because that is programming that is one of the easiest ways to program your subconscious mind is moving pictures and feelings okay and so when we're watching certain things or listening to certain like music and stuff like that like music bring a frequency so that brings an emotion that brings in a feeling and if you're feeling that even if you're not even experiencing it in your life just say like a, a heartbreak song you're not even experiencing you're in a love and joyful but you're listening to that song that stuff is programming you if you're not aware of it okay it don't have to if you are consciously aware and you can you know let your brain know but mindful of the things that we are actually watching the things that we are listening to um the things that we are even taking because food is a, a spiritual mindful practice and even myself i, I i'm uh, striving to get better with it so ask yourself that the things that we're reading you know so many different stuff so just ask yourself are we getting are we outside in nature are we allowing ourselves to be grounded you know are, are we working on maybe yoga maybe you're doing some tai chi maybe you're doing some kijong maybe you are doing uh like sound healing bowls Whatever the case may be, whatever, whatever is your forte, what your spirit is saying that you need to do in order for that your body to be in alignment to the greatness is that it's about to be bestowed on you. But we have to do those things. You cannot expect to be getting such divine messages if your, your, your gut is literally full of junk. It can't. I'm not saying that, that God cannot work through all of that stuff. Of course. Of course, of course, you can be in horrible shape and still get divine messages from God. I'm not speaking about that, of course. But if we're being mindful about truly being mindful, okay, and truly want the thing that you want, only you really know what it is that you want. And I'm talking to myself out loud, too, because I have to seriously make some more change. And, and the first thing, like I said, not eating at night like that and then going to sleep, 
and getting my, my workout routine more, even up in my water take, more fruits and vegetables in my body, start doing some type of energetic motion, maybe some, some Tai Chi or something, yoga, whatever the case may be, get some massages and stuff, get that energy flowing, but we have to get our vessels correct. We have to, if we want to get to the level of pure fulfillment for wh whatever that looks like to you. So that's what came to me. So go for it, go for it. And definitely text that number to best you so that we can stay connected. Cause I'm out here, I'm doing this for my tribe. I'm doing this for my tribe, baby. All right, I love y'all. Keep loving yourself, peace.